Birthday, happy birthday. I love the simple, beautiful peach, especially when it's ripe and fuzzy. What's up, cereal heads? Today we're gonna do a quick little video about two new cereals that just hit shelves. Peach Cheerios and Birthday Cake Cookie Crisp. Now these two cereals are from General Mills and they're just tweaks on two of their classic popular brands. Let's start off by talking about Birthday Cake Cookie Crisp. Now, right from the jump, you can see the cookies in this are kind of vanilla wafer types with sprinkles on them, a departure from the normal chocolate chip cookies of Cookie Crisp but colorful sprinkles aren't entirely new. Back in 2009, they introduced Sprinkles Cookie Crisp, which looked very similar to this new birthday cake cookie crisp. And then in 2014, General Mills released this holiday Sprinkles Cookie Crisp for the Christmas season. These sugar cookies had red and green sprinkles on them. Now this cereal is not to be confused with classic Christmas Cookie Crisp, which came out back in the early 90s, I think. In this version, the cookies were actually red and green with white sprinkles on them. This variety of Cookie Crisp was delicious. Now those other sprinkle varieties of Cookie Crisp tasted like sugar cookies, if I remember correctly. It's been a while since I've had them and they're not around anymore. So this new birthday cake version is at least a different taste, if not a different look. And it is kind of funny how certain trends catch on in the cereal world. For example, Kellogg's releases new unicorn cereal and General Mills counters by releasing new unicorn marbits in Lucky Charms. And likewise, Kellogg's unicorn cereal is a cupcake flavor and General Mills counters by releasing their own birthday cake flavored cereal. It's like a game of chess between the major cereal companies. Now personally, I'd much rather than bring back the oatmeal raisin variety of Cookie Crisp, but I know that cookie flavor flavor is kind of controversial and not liked by everyone, so I doubt it'll happen. So in the back of this birthday cake cookie crisp box, they have a little maze where you can collect decorations for Chip's birthday party and guess the words with missing letters. All right, enough talk. Let's open up this new cookie crisp and take a look. So here's what a bowl of this new birthday cake cookie crisp looks like. You can see it's got multicolored sprinkles, but they're not as bright or vibrant as I thought they'd be. The picture on the box definitely made it look more colorful than it actually looks in person. Let's hit it with some milk. So I'll admit I might not have the most discerning palette when it comes to identifying artificial cake flavors, but this stuff definitely doesn't have a strong birthday cake flavor to it. It's definitely sweet, almost too sweet. Two. But for me, it doesn't have that strong vanilla, cakey, frosting flavor to it. If you're the kind of person who loves and craves that cake or cupcake flavor, well, I'd probably pick up unicorn cereal first, but this one's not a bad second choice. And again, neither of them compare to my favorite, Cupcake Pebbles, which came out back in 2010. This one was delicious. All right, let's move on to the other new cereal, New Peach Cheerios. Now, General Mills has been releasing different flavors of Cheerios for years, and in the past couple years, they started releasing varieties made with real fruit and real ingredients. The boxes for these new varieties have taken on the same sort of organic look. A bowl of Cheerios in the middle there with the ingredients surrounding it to give it a more fresh and natural feel. They've had strawberry Cheerios, pumpkin spice Cheerios with a pumpkin and some cinnamon there, a very berry version of Cheerios with strawberries, raspberries, and blueberries, banana nut Cheerios, which is an older version, but they reintroduced it with this new box look. And then most recently, a chocolate peanut butter version of Cheerios. And you can see this limited edition peach Cheerios follows the same box design. Now, peach season is anywhere from around May to September, but in my humble opinion, peaches are best between July and August. When I live down in South Carolina in the summer months, we get the best delicious juicy peaches from Georgia, and it wasn't a July 4th picnic without some fresh peach pie. Now last year, blueberries seemed to be the fruit of choice amongst cereal manufacturers. And when I made a video about blueberry cereals, I pondered the question of what would be the go-to fruit for 2018. I wonder what seasonal fruit will be the star of 2018. Maybe peaches. I love peaches. Now to be fair, it doesn't seem like peaches are taking this year by storm, but nonetheless, I'm happy that General Mills made my peach love a reality. There have been honey bunches of oats and Special K and some other smaller brands that use peaches in them, but it's never really been a dominant flavor in the cereal world. And that's a shame because peaches are so good. So let's open up this limited edition Cheerios and give them a try. So here's what a bowl of these peach Cheerios look like. You can see they have a slight orange hue to them. That's probably attributed to the peach puree used to make this cereal. Gotta say, I'm really excited to try these. Mmm, that's really good. I haven't come across a Cheerios flavor that I don't like, and these are no different. The peach flavor isn't super strong, but I love that. It's not as overpowering as a strawberry or very berry version, but you definitely get that bright peach flavor, which makes this a perfect summertime cereal. It's not the peak of peach season yet, so I feel a little weird indulging in this, but it's not gonna stop me from enjoying this whole bowl. 
And I'm definitely gonna finish this entire box by the end of this week. This one is a home run for me. I'm a little biased because I've been wanting a peach cereal for a while now. But if you like peaches and you like Cheerios, well, I definitely recommend you pick this one up while it's still available. Hopefully it sticks around until the end of peach season. I can't imagine they'll pull this off shelves before August. I'm just happy Cheerios keeps trying new flavors. I guess the question now is what's gonna be the next seasonal variety from Cheerios? Mango Cheerios? Orange Cheerios? Cherry Cheerios? Pear Cheerios? Ooh, I love pears. Pears are one of my favorite fruits and I don't think we've ever had a pear flavored cereal before. Ball's in your court, General Mills. Make it happen. All right, so that's gonna do it for these two new cereals. Make sure you pick up Peach Cheerios and new birthday cake cookie crisp while they're still on shelves. As always, thanks for watching and until next time, stay crunchy. Ooh, peach flavored birthday cake. Thank <laughs> you.